The camera industry has been buzzing with excitement lately, especially after Canon unveiled the R6 Mark III, a move that has photographers and videographers eagerly adjusting their plans for 2025. While Canon made headlines, all eyes are now shifting towards Sony, a brand that has consistently delivered groundbreaking mirrorless technology. Today, we're diving deep into everything known about the upcoming Sony A75, based on verified sources, leaks, and industry trends. This is not just speculation. This is the type of insider intel that helps creators optimize their content for searches like Sony mirrorless 2025 launch, Sony A75 rumors, Canon R6 Mark III versus Sony A75, and best hybrid full-frame camera 2025. For anyone looking to stay ahead in the hybrid mirrorless space, this is essential information. So, make sure to like this video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of the upcoming long-form, keyword-rich insights we'll be sharing throughout this series. One of the first major points to consider is announcement timing. Unlike Sony's usual schedule, which traditionally favors mid-October to mid-November for major full-frame camera launches, Multiple sources now indicate that the A75 will be revealed in early December, likely in the first week. Historically, Sony's launch dates have varied. One year saw November 19th, another November 7th, while previous years favored late October. This deviation to December is intriguing. Could it be a tactical move to counter the Canon R6 Mark III's momentum? Or are supply chain adjustments influencing the delay? Regardless of the reason, this unusual timing is likely to drive significant search interest across platforms, particularly on YouTube, as users look for Sony Early December Release or Sony A75 launch date. For creators, this presents an excellent opportunity to publish content that aligns with trending searches and maximizes algorithmic visibility. Next, shipping and pre-order windows are key elements to consider. According to reliable sources, Sony is planning to ship the first A75 units before Christmas. This means that those who pre-order immediately after the announcement could receive their cameras as early as late December, rather than waiting until the new year. This fast turnaround is an essential talking point for content creators, offering hooks such as how to pre-order the Sony A75, be among the first to receive the A75, and Sony A75 shipping before Christmas. These hooks naturally create urgency, prompting viewers to act quickly, increasing engagement, watch time, and ultimately, YouTube ranking. For creators looking to capitalize on these trends, highlighting early access and pre-order details can be a powerful strategy. When it comes to sensor and imaging architecture, this is where the A75 starts to stand out in a meaningful way. Verified rumors suggest that Sony will equip the A75 with a new 33 megapixel stack sensor, paired with an AI-driven image processing engine. This combination promises a notable leap in autofocus speed, readout rate, low light performance, and video capabilities. Discussions on photography forums and Reddit threads indicate that pre-capture AI features will be present, boosting autofocus accuracy and burst shooting efficiency. Industry sources, including Digital Camera World, have emphasized areas where they expect improvements, such as enhanced stabilization, faster mechanical shutter burst speeds, and refined AI-powered processing. Creators can naturally weave in keywords like Sony A75 stack sensor, Sony A75 AI autofocus, and mirrorless sensor readout comparison to boost visibility. These improvements indicate a significant upgrade over prior A7 series cameras delivering both professional photo quality and hybrid video performance that modern content creators demand. On the front body design front, leaked images reveal that the A75's exterior closely resembles the A7R5, ensuring familiarity for existing Sony shooters. Grips, ergonomics, and overall layout are consistent, but one notable difference is the absence of the C5 custom button near the lens mount which had been present in earlier models like the A12. While some might assume this removes pre-capture functionality, it's more likely that Sony has relocated it or integrated it into the software interface. 
The similarity to the A7R5 body design ensures current Sony users won't face steep adaptation curves, and it also p. reserves compatibility with the existing lens ecosystem. This is a strong point when contrasting the A75 with Canon's R6 Mark III, which may require users to adapt to new mirrorless lens options. Keywords like Sony A75 body design leak, A75 versus A7 are five comparison, and Sony mirrorless lens compatibility 2025 can be naturally used in your video to improve search relevance. From a speculation versus confirmed specs perspective, the A75 is expected to feature a 33MP sensor, mechanical shutter burst speeds likely exceeding 10 frames per second, potentially reaching 12 frames per second or higher. Video capabilities are rumored to include uncropped 4K 60p, possibly even 4K 120p, paired with an improved IBIS system rated up to 8 stops, compared to the A74's 5.5 stops. Advanced EVF enhancements, superior connectivity, and AI-assisted autofocus round out the expected feature set. Pricing rumors suggest a body-only price under US$3,000, positioning it directly against the Canon R6 Mark III, which is priced around $2,799. These competitive factors make the A75 a compelling option for hybrid shooters, offering value in both photography and videography workflows. For creators building content around the A75, the focus should include both technical specifications and practical applications. Discuss how AI-powered autofocus, high-speed readout, and enhanced stabilization impact real-world shooting scenarios. Compare the hybrid functionality against the Canon R6 Mark III, highlighting areas such as burst speed, sensor resolution, and video versatility. Engage viewers with questions like, which camera would you choose for hybrid shooting in 2025? Or would you prioritize autofocus speed over resolution? Incorporating interactive elements, such as polls and comments, encourages engagement, improving video retention rates, and algorithmic ranking. Finally, long-form content should naturally integrate high-value keywords throughout the script. Terms like Sony A75 launch date, Sony A75 rumors, Sony A75 specs leaked, Sony vs. Canon R6 Mark III, Best mirrorless camera 2025, full frame hybrid camera, AI autofocus mirrorless, and Sony mirrorless ecosystem 2025 should appear seamlessly in narration. These keywords, combined with actionable tips, comparisons, and insider insights, make the video not only informative but optimized for discoverability. Repeating calls to action such as subscribe for exclusive Sony A75 rumors. Or drop a comment if you're planning to buy the Sony A75 or Canon R6 Mark III boosts engagement and signals audience activity to YouTube, further improving visibility. By weaving together announcement timing, pre-order details, sensor upgrades, leaked body design, specs comparison, pricing, and hybrid functionality, your content will not only inform viewers but also help it rank from multiple related searches. As new information becomes available, such as official press invites, registration notices, or additional leaks. Creating follow-up videos keeps your audience engaged and positions your channel as a reliable source for Sony A75 coverage in 2025. Ultimately, the Sony A75 represents a critical step forward in mirrorless camera evolution, and building content that is thorough, keyword-rich, and engaging ensures both discovery and credibility among photography enthusiasts and hybrid shooters worldwide.